So today I have a quick makeup tutorial for you guys. I'm currently during exam period so um, the videos have gone down a bit lately but I did still want to get a video up for you guys. I'm also going to film a quick beauty haul for you guys so that should be up in the next few days. So for today's makeup tutorial I have used Deck of Scarlet um, and here it is. And basically Deck of Scarlet is kind of like a makeup subscription but it's every two months. Um, and this is what it looks like. You have like your palette and the lip chubby. And basically each palette is in collaboration with a really big YouTuber and this month it's with the lovely Babs Beauty. This is kind of like what the palette looks like and it comes like with a little mirror and then you've got your three eyeshadows and then kind of like kind of like a highlight and I would say a blush but you can use this on the eyes as well which I did. And you got your two colours, lip colours I mean. And it also comes with like a lip chubby. I would definitely say though, there's a lot of quality, like just the box, just the cardboard box alone is like good quality, but it's definitely super sturdy and the colours are very pigmented. Yeah, it just feels very luxurious and that's what I really like about it. It's just, you're definitely getting your value for money. So it does cost $29.95 every other month. So you're basically, getting a palette every two months. You can also buy the palettes on their own, so you can get the previous one, or you could get this one if you missed this month's subscription, um, but that is like $44 or something, so you're paying much more, so it's definitely worth if you get it in the subscription time, I would say. But it's, I think it's still nice to have that option to still get the previous palettes, because if you like some of the previous ones and you want to collect them all, you can do so and if you collect all the palettes it kind of looks like a deck of cards I would say it's kind of cool I think it's really cool I also really love the fact that they're cruelty free paraben free and they're also made in the USA so it's not like made in China or anything like that it's made in the USA so you know it's legit and I don't know like look at the highlight look at the highlight to be honest like my two favorite like it's so weird but I love the highlight and I love the um, this color for eyeshadow and also as a blusher I think it's a really really cool concept like the fact that you're getting a palette every two months that's in collaboration with a youtuber I feel like it makes I feel like it's so cool but anyways the link will be in the info box if you want to grab this month's deck of scarlet palette and I will jump straight into the video and I do want to say that when I started filming I already had my base done so everything will be linked in the um, info box so I thought I'd show you a bit of like a close up of the palette, it comes with a little slit. The palette does have a lot of purple peachy tones in it so I just really love it, like those kind of colours. I love peach at the moment as you guys. I'm first going to use this colour Bob D which is a nice purple I would say um, and it's all matte so I really like to use this as a transition colour so I'm just going to use a fluffy brush and buff this into my crease and as I go up towards the brow I do use less pressure with the brush so it kind of fades out and creates a nice transition basically. Next I'm going to use this colour called Making Mauve which it is a basically a mauve colour and it's matte as well and it's a bit darker so I'm using this underneath Bob D and this is going to really deepen out the crease and I really wanted to create like a halo eye it's kind of like one of my favorite eye kind of looks um, so I just buffed that in and now I'm using peachy keens and I'm pressing this with my finger on the center so it really makes that halo effect stand out it really makes the lid pop so yeah you can use a flat shader brush for this, but when I do halo eyes, I really prefer to use my finger. Now I'm going to use the shade Sophia, which is a super vibrant, shimmery kind of purple. And I really wanted this on my lower lash line, so I used a flat shader brush from Sigma and just kind of buffed it out. I also did kind of flick it up to kind of create a wing but just a little bit so it kind of straightened it out a bit and blended the bottom bit with the top bit. I also curl my lashes and um, for mascara I'm using the Maybelline Lash Sensational as always and I packed on a lot of mascara. I did it on my top and bottom. You can use lashes if you want to but I thought for this look I'll just keep it with my real lashes. Um, after that I'm using some bronzer, this is the MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in Dark Deep just to add a bit of colour and co contour a bit my cheeks 
and then next I'm using Bob D again as a blusher oh my goodness it's so nice as a blusher you wouldn't think purple would be nice as a blush but it's actually really nice it's super nice especially if you're a deeper skin tone you could use it if you're a lighter skin tone but I feel like it really complements a tan skin tone now I'm going to use the highlighter and this is gilded and I'm going to just put this on my cheekbones I did go on my, the bridge of my nose my temples and the cupid's bow as well but it's so vibrant like the more you pack it on the more intense it becomes it's so nice and it doesn't go ashy on me either so so good um now i'm going to use the lip chubby and i just apply this all over my lips it's super creamy you can wear it on its own but i did go in with the lip color brownie on top and i just blended the two together and it creates a nice kind of mauve brown look the lip colours are super super creamy, so so creamy, so comfortable and not sticky whatsoever. So that's what I really like about it. So yeah, that's what the lip chubby and brownie looks like together. It's a nice mauvey brown. And now I'm going to use plump and put this all over my lips just to show you that colour as well. But I feel like this colour really brings light to my my face. Just like it just really brightens everything up. I just love it. It's so nice. And you could also pair it with a lip liner if you don't want it too bright. But yeah guys, that's the end of this tutorial. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget there's a link in the info box if you do want to subscribe to Deck of Scarlet. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!